have had the best time tonight. We are at a uh, shop called The Wine Rack in Huntsville, Alabama. And this is um, an event that has now been named Wine Rack, Wine Rack Brush Strokes. And um, the person that named it has actually gotten her prize tonight. I want to show you a technique. Um, last month, one of our regulars requested a Mardi Gras mask. So this is a wild Mardi Gras mask beginning. This is one version. And we're going to walk over here. Hold on, let me get the garbage out of the way. <laughs> Clean up. All right. And this is a version where the artist has put a tint on her paper with the watercolor first. And she has laid water within her pencil lines and let the colors then bleed into one another. This is our artist that requested the mask and she has chosen to put a peachy kind of amber colored wash down first. And she added a piece of uh, gimp down here, uh, some trim and is, uh, she's our colorist. We never know what she's going to do, so she will have. She, she is a rebel. That's exactly what she is, our rebel. And so she will send me a picture in several weeks. She will take it home and um, and proceed from here. Now I'm not sure what to call this artist because we have so much fun. She never finishes it here. Now she always says she's going to finish it at home, and she is good friends with our rebel. So. We, we will see if the rebel uh, pulls it off to <laughs> encourage her to finish it. Now, she was a little concerned about the rough edges, and my suggestion is to take a um, felt tip marker, not the fine point, but the little bit wider one, and she can go over those edges, and by putting the black around all those perimeters, she can pull this together and I'm hoping that she will really do that and send me a picture and um, we'll have it down the road. So again, it's a Mardi Gras night here in Huntsville, Alabama and we've had a great time and uh, hope you're having a party wherever you are.